Hello, welcome to uh, the 10th week, um, this is also the 10th chapter, uh, families, and how, you know, families, you know, influence our part of, you know, our human behavior and part of our environment. I'm not going to go uh, over the learning objective. And um, a reminder that you know, this is the um, case study for this chapter. Please use the material in the chapter to um, deal with the and answer the discussion um, questions and exercise. Um, this is just the, the overall outline well we we have uh many um different um you know definitions for a family um so uh, you can all read um you know the definition uh but we can have uh families um you know that we create by you know, marriage or uh, some other legal or not legal, um, you know, either institution or or uh, procedure. Um, now, um, we also have, you know, family as, you know, sharing a uh, residential unit. Um, you know, we have... Uh, you know, different roles, you know, if there's a husband, a wife, uh, mother, father, daughter, brother, or, you know, it could be, you know, people of the same gender um, having the role of being parents and, and so on. And we also have uh, the family as, you know, the creator of, you know, culture, a, uh, you know, what we share as, you know, a common culture uh, due to our religion, our place of origin, and so on and so forth. Um, so, um, just to to remind you a little bit of. Um, you know, Marlowe's hierarchy, hierarchy of needs. Um, and this is how it, it, it applies to hierarchy of human tribe or the human tribe, um, where, you know, on the bottom, you see the self. Yeah, us. You know, we're, uh, we take care of our, our self first, right? And, and, uh, you know, then we have family as the second um, step, then religion, uh, nation, state, job, um, friends, you know, and the whole uh, as a species. Um, this is also, as she mentioned, this is a sort of Americanized uh, version. Um, we're not going to discuss um, other hierarchies here um but sufficient to know that yes there are there are others so as you can see family you know it is way um you know important uh when it comes to the heart hierarchical um of us as, as humans um you know it's our uh, um sorry is our first, you know, contact, I would say, with um, society, you know, our parents, our brothers, sisters, uncles, grandparents, etc. So, you know, like I said, there, there could be many ways um, that families uh, can be defined, you know, uh, biological, you know, legally, um, even uh, 
socially, which is not necessarily n not biological, no legal, you know, uh, we, I'm sure we all have our uncles who are, you know, basically, you know, our relatives, right, either by one way or another, you know, we have, um, you know, godparents that, you know, you may can see their family, even if they're not blood related, and so on and so forth. Um, let's keep going. Um, so, you know, uh, I may have said some of this already. You know, uh, there are four approaches to defining a family. You know, the structure, you know, either, um, yeah, there, there could be legal, but it could also be, uh, you know, not, not legal, although depending on uh, the state, I think, you know, uh, um, what's the term I'm trying to remember, you know, when two people uh, have been together for a while, you know, a number of years, you know, some state consider that uh, a common marriage, I think, yes, I think that's what it's called. I'm not sure what are the rules or laws in, in Mississippi, but, you know, I'm sure there's some of um, you know, it's probably somewhere in the, uh, um, you know, in the books. Uh, as a household, use, meaning, you know, residential unit, you know, we sometimes have, you know, people who are close to us, may, you know, even if there's not uh, family, uh, family roles, I mentioned that, you'll know what that is, and family, you know, uh, an interaction with you know, it's a sort of first um, um, contact with culture and, um, you know, customs, you know, food, religion, etc. Um, this is basically, you know, sort of uh, explanatory, you know, um, I guess to add a little bit uh, to the definition, you know, it doesn't have to be only by blood, by law. But it could be affection. You know, you care something. Uh, you care so much about somebody that you know it's 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 a family member. So, um, so why do we, you know, or why are 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 families, you know, important? Well, you know, we, I mentioned culture, right? Well, it helps us, you know, uh, in our socialization. Also, in procreation, you know, um, there's more, um, you know, our, our culture, our genetics, etc. are kept uh, being alive. Some people are, you know, very keen on um, keeping, you know, a last name, a history, a heritage, etc. Mutual, mutual support, you know. Uh, you know, a lot of us and many people, um, you know, consider family the first, um, you know, the first thing, the first people you the text or call or, you know, reach to, right? Now, there's, there's, there's really, uh, I, especially uh, today, as we know it, I mean, there's, I wouldn't uh, venture to define what's a normal family is you know I, I think that um like i said you know it could be uh blood um legal or you know affection love right um let's see yep i think that's pretty much it for that uh slide so you know, it's in, you know, if, if we consider ourselves that, you know, at one point in our development, meaning, you know, or, uh, back in the, you know, sort of the caveman uh, time, you know, where we had to, you know, either hunt and um, to get our, our meals, you know, we depend then on 
on, on a family, on, on a group, to um, survive. Um, you know, you can argue that, um, or, or, you know, we still depend on, on that to, you know, um, survive. I mean, uh, especially a good example right now, right, with the pandemic, how, you know, many parents are, are had to, not that they never were, you know, like a mother or a father, you know, it, 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 it's a therapist, it's a, it's a nurse, it's a doctor, it's a health, uh, mental health, uh, uh, therapist, you know, it's a playing, you know, a teacher, a, 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 et cetera, but no other, well, I guess, especially now, you know, uh, those, uh, responsibilities of roles have become so uh, important you know we're spending you know so much time uh, together and you know sometimes um, things go well and sometimes it it, it, it doesn't but um, I, I'm hopeful that you know if, if this were to uh, you know continue you know it would hopefully get to some sort of normalization. You know, some people uh, argue that, uh, you know, like abuse, uh, you know, child abuse or even domestic violence have increased during this pandemic because, you know, we're spending so much time together and, you know, sometimes we get angry at each other or, or tired. But, you know, I'm, I'm hopeful that, you know, with... Uh, like anything else, we will adapt. And I think that, I mean, although I don't think it will last long enough to to, to make it to that transition, but, um, you know, certainly um, I would think that's, that's the case, uh, that we would um, learn to, you know, under new circumstances, you know, there's going to be trial and error, but... Um, I think the, the family, <laughs> I mean, ultimately, it will either uh, stay together or some may, you know, uh, uh, you know fall apart and, and, and leave. And, you know, we have to um, see that as, you know, a natural, um, you know, consequences, you know. Um, Yeah, we have, you know, families um, in this country, you know, have, um, have brought a, a lot of um, uh, traditions, um, um, even, um, you know, how marriage is formed, you know, how uh, ch children should be um, race, you know, gender roles, and, you know, we have, um, have many, um, changes, you know, um, you know, we've seen how more women, uh, in the 60s, uh, starting, you know, um, were part of the labor force, um, and now, you know, basically, um, you know, most women will, at some point, uh, as well as men, you know, will be part of the of the labor force. Um, that's not to say that uh, we all, in one way or another, will contribute to our the development of our um, family structure, family household. So there's uh, a few uh, theoretical or theory um, here, and and I remind you that you know please use the uh, this series to when you discuss the um, case studies. One of them is the family system perspective. So the family system perspective is one of the 
you know, most used in, in, in social work. Um, the focus on the relationship, um, you know, with the family, uh, rather than individual family members, you know, and, and then that we're all, or the family is interconnected. Um, and there are some, you know, boundaries, the rules, you know, verbal, non-verbal communication patterns, like, you know, you don't do that in, you know, in this family, you know, and then it's a multi-level uh, uh, family uh, practice model because it involves, you know, even um, uh, some, uh, you know, generations to understand um, what, um, you know, what it sort of came from. Um, so, the differentiation uh, of self, which uh, was uh, one of uh, Murray Bowen's, um, you know, who, who, uh, who uh, you know, proposed uh, one of the f uh, main uh, propose, uh, proposers of this uh, theory. Um, so, you know, you know, how do we uh, dif differentiate our, our, ourselves? So, and that is divided into differentiation between thinking and, and, and feeling, you know, um, you know, sometimes you, you have your, um, their own thinking, uh, uh, but, uh, you know, you, you have to, um, sort of, um, pay, uh, you know, that, uh, the family, um, uh, network, uh, unit, you know, um, um, you know, have some, um, way of, uh, you know, behaving, you know, uh, you may think one way, but, you know, you, you may um, behave another way. Differentiation between self and other members of the family, you know, even though, you, you know, you recognize that you are, you know, independent, but, you know, um, sometimes you have to, you know, behave a certain way to be, you know, approve or part of the, the family. And, and like I mentioned before, you know, we, we would um, look at multi-generation to, you know, um, get a gain perspective on, you know, how, um, a, you know, the family um, sort of tree uh, uh, influence behavior, and one way is, you know, genograms, and we see um, one here. Um, because of time, I'm not going to discuss it, but, you know, it can get as, uh, as complicated as you can make it. I do um, include it in this uh, PowerPoint a video about genograms. So, and, um, and I also, I believe GenoPro is a, is a software to, uh, you know, help you create genograms. Um, so, let's see, is this, no, this is, um, this is the chart family eco map during, uh, uh, you know, the, our case study deployment to, to Afghanistan. You know, um, so you can see, you know, all of this um, influences, and um, you know, um, uh, we have here employment. You know. Um, 
you know, all of those different, you know, family members, uh, church, uh, obviously National Guard, uh, and so on. I believe this is a, a video which I suggest you click on it uh, when you have a chance to, uh, that talks about um, Ecomaps. The Family Life uh, Cycle Perspective um, you know, it expands the uh, uh, family system perspective, um, and um, to look, you know, uh, to look at families, you know, through time, um, you know, um, because you know time change. Um, there's points, you know, that are, you know, a transition. Um, you know, there could be, you know, if you married. Uh, this lead to a different family that may um, involve, I don't know, moving or uh, even in some cases uh, changing religion and, you know, other um, things like uh, life uh, uh, situations like that. Yeah, this, this diagram may help um, us understand better the uh, family life cycle. Uh, you know, and so we have, um, it depends on where we start, you know, leave home, uh, married, or leave home, go to college, then marriage, you know, you know, family, children, and, you know, then the children leave the, the home, um, you know, and you become old, and, you know, the, the cycle keeps, you know, going um you know there's there's different at uh, different steps you know or different part of the cycle you know there's different um behaviors and and choices that we make and so as you know social workers you know we need to understand where uh, what stage are we um, dealing you know because they have different needs and 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 um, necessities and um, you know uh, how they rate you know uh, at scale of of um, uh, what things are important at, at that uh, particular time. Um, we also have the exchange and choices perspective on families. Um, so, you know, uh, going back to the, the cycle, you know, we have um, uh, times where, you know, you may uh, want to uh, maximize, you know, uh, some uh, outcomes uh, because of the situation that you're um, on. Um, um, for instance, now with, if you have a family, you have children in school, um, you know, due to the, uh, pandemic, you may, um, uh, you know, focus, uh, a lot on, on education because you know that, you know, it may not be, you know, the best because, you know, they're missing on, on, um, you know, that face to face. Uh, contact with the teacher, they also may be missing on, you know, socialization um, with their, you know, friends. So you may um, try to compensate for that and, you know, and maximize, so maximize um, uh, things that you took for granted. They're not that for granted now uh, because of our current situation in terms of the um, you know the bias. Uh, yeah, so there's four assumption on this perspective. You know, humans act out of self-interest. Sure. Human make choices about relationships. Yeah, you know, humans are rational in their choices. Well, we make that assumption. Social relationships are characterized by interdependence and reciprocity. Yeah, you know, we we create those relations because we they 
you know, hopefully our friends and family and our, you know, uh, relationship we build, you know, it's a two-way street. And, um, you know, they, you know, it, put it blunt, bluntly, we get a benefit and hopefully they also get a, uh, a benefit from, you know, the interaction. So, uh, we have Rust Bolt, you know, uh, propose uh, the investment model of social exchange, uh, you know, that considers the level of commitment in relation. And uh, there's three uh, conditions that enhance commitment, you know, you know, high level of satisfaction with the relationship, right? You know, if, if, if this, you know, you have a friend or even a family member and, you know, you don't see much gain, you know, or, or satisfaction, you know, may, may not uh, develop in a lot of commitment. Um, alternate relation are perceived to be unavailable or unattractive. Um, y yeah, um, you know, um, um, I don't, I don't know, maybe it's, uh, oh God, I, I would have to make it a, an extreme example, you know, um, you know, you live in a bad neighborhood, so, you know, those relationships may not be what you, you know, benefit you the most, so you um, start other um, relationships that, you know, are more satisfying. Um, yeah, and then you know, there's a history of investing in resources in the relation and receiving resources from the relation, you know, the give and take, right? Um, the symbolic interaction perspective on families, um, you can pretty much, um, you know, read uh, this part. So, okay, to make this uh, uh, shorter and hopefully easy to understand, you know, uh, as a society, um, you know, and groups, we may, you know, give meaning to you know, symbol and, you know, even acts. Um, uh, for instance, you know, if you show um, your guess you fam, right, a, a picture of a tiger, right, it would mean one thing. But if you show somebody from another institution, you know, which you know, it could be that their um, symbol is also a tiger. They would think of something else. You know, for you it may mean, you know, football, uh, the marching band. Um, you know, when you think of, of sports, you know, some people may react, you know, differently. You know, uh, you know, um, if you see even... Uh, you know, I don't know, let's say a MAGA hat, you see MAGA, and then you would, that may prompt you to, you know, like, yeah, I don't want to be even close to that person, or, you know, whatever, uh, and, you know, those are, those are, are symbols that, you know, people uh, attach to, you know, certain images, and, and even uh, behaviors, right? How we uh, you know, react how we uh, conduct ourselves in in, uh, in different um, occasions. You know, the the world, the the term, uh, you know, a re ritual, right? Um, we 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 have certain rituals to, um, you know, anything from you know, go to work. You know, we get a certain time, live a certain time, dress in a certain way, you know, maybe, you know, you say, um, good morning to everybody, you know, and, and so on and, and, and so forth. So, uh, role, you know, it's, it's a central part of the symbolic interaction. Um, you know, 
if you're the mother or the father, you know, that's, that's a role, right? The teacher, the, you, know, you name it, the social worker, right? There's also, you know, uh, things are, are, are changing uh, now, but, you know, a gender uh, role, you know, symbolic, you know, we tend to think one way or, or another or attribute males or females certain, you know, characteristics. Um, um, there's a nice video here, too, uh, due to time, you know, um, I may not um, get to, uh, you know, discuss everything. Um, I'm already 30 minutes in, so I'm going to stop here. Uh, what I'll do is that I will add, uh, hopefully, uh, some material and maybe videos or images into the rest of the uh, uh, PowerPoint to help you, uh, you know, go over this material. So, uh, keep taking good care of yourself. Um, remember, we're close to that time, meaning voting. Uh, please do encourage everybody to do that and, um, you know, t stay healthy. Stay safe, um, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.